My name is Clara Pena, and I have an idea for an adventure thriller movie titled The Open Boat. It's a true story written by the correspondent that was in war, which is also one of our four protagonists along with the captain of the ship, the oiler, and the cook. These four audacious men are trying to survive and to get an island they have seen far away, but they realize that they can get there swimming. It's too risky. But all of a sudden, they visualize the men in the sun beckoning at them to go to a life-saving station. We're safe, they thought. One more night passed for them. They were hoping with strong and powerful faith to get rescued that night. That awful night, it was one of the most difficult nights since they shipwrecked. The boat was about to flip and they could all have drawn. It was crucial for them to keep the boat straight, otherwise it could flip. They got tired of waiting, so after planning the operation, the captain explained to the ship boys what they will have to do if they want to get out of this alive. They came as near as they could to the shore and they jumped and swam as fast as they could to get to the shore. Finally, after fighting to powerful currents, they used all his strength left to get to the coast alive. A man who was there tried to help them. What surprised them a lot was all the people that were on the beach received them with towels, blankets and some food and drinks. But sadly, one of the sheep boys that were with them couldn't make it after hoarding so long lost in the sea. <laughs> they finally succeeded in a decision made, but unfortunately, one of them has stayed half away. The Open Boat by Stephen Crane is a true story based on the author's experience on surviving to the sinking of the ship when he traveled from Florida to Cuba as a newspaper correspondent. He spent 30 hours sailing in a small boat trying to survive with three other men, the captain, the oiler, and the cook. This short story is Man versus Nature. Because the four men tried to survive, although all the obstacles nature insisted on putting in front of them. They could all live except for the oiler that had drawn in the sea.